when you look at um, the offensive staff, it, it's almost completely new. What do you think yeah. that uh, What do you think that means? Did, it, does it Does the offense look significantly different to kind of maximize what you have in Deshaun Watson? Yeah, I, th- I think at, at the end of the day, that's the bottom line here, Dave. Is I think it's I think it's fresh perspective as much as anything else. I think it's it's new eyes to maybe look at ways to getting this offense to open up. We didn't see much of it last year, again, until Joe Flacco got here at the end of November. Um, I think the Browns really struggled early on to identify what their strengths were, and I think that is, you know, part and parcel with losing Nick Chubb in Week Two. I think there was going to be a real emphasis on giving the ball to Nick Chubb as much as they possibly could last year. I think he probably would have led the league in in, in touches, in attempts. Um, they finally fe- felt like they had a quarterback that would best complement Nick and vice versa. And unfortunately, that just didn't happen. And I think the, you know Stefanski and his staff spent numerous weeks trying to figure out, okay, who are who are we? What is our identity? So, you know, th- these were massive changes. You know, I I hated to see Alex Van Pelt leave only because I thought he was not only a good guy, but I thought he did a really nice job behind the scenes and what I've been able to find out, you know, in terms of, of getting this offense up and going. Um, obviously, the loss of Bill Callahan is a major blow to this team. You know, he's regarded as, if not the best, one of the best offensive line coaches in the NFL. So that's a big loss. You know, I think it remains to be seen what Ken Dorsey's role is here. We don't know yet about whether or not he's going to be calling the plays. I, I don't think the Browns even know that yet. I don't think Kevin Stefanski has made a, a firm decision on that as well. So I think to your point, Dave, I think more than anything else, this is about maximizing what you have in this quarterback, a quarterback that you've invested $230 million into a quarterback that is now two years in with very little return. So I think it's about, getting fresh perspective, new eyes, new ideas in this offense, and and trying to get it to go.